What's up Blade fam? So today we're here at Memorial Skate Park and we are going to learn how to drop in. I did do this uh, tutorial already on my rollerblading quick tips video but this is going to be just specifically dropping in and preparing for the other side of the transition. Without further ado, let's get into it. So when it comes to dropping in, you should have a very strong foundation in just rolling. Um, perhaps already experienced rolling around on transitions, different banks, and maybe even going up quarter pipes would be a good idea. After that point, what you want to do is find a certain quarter pipe. In this case, we're at a mini. I think it's about six feet high, kind of steep for a beginner. If you are just starting, maybe find a smaller or lower quarter pipe, something around four foot, just to get associated with the dropping in. After you've mastered that, all quarter pipes and vert ramps are pretty much the same, excluding this big monster we got on this side, which I'll be covering later. All right, so dropping in. Um, depending if you skate right foot back or left foot back, this will vary. For me, I skate right foot back, so when I get ready to drop in, I come to the edge, I look where I want to go. I want to drop in and go straight that way. Sometimes when people are dropping in, they just tend to look down, and that creates the momentum after you drop in to fall forward or fall down. So remember to keep your head neutral and looking forward. You're gonna just get to the edge, place your left skate onto the coping, and you're gonna just go in and absorb. Now, most of this is just gonna be dealing with the fear aspects of it. I think everybody uh, has the fear of just imploding as they hit the bottom of this bank or uh, this quarter pipe or losing control and crashing in on the other side. So if you're just learning, try and start on a quarter pipe, get associated with the momentum of dropping in and then take it to a half pipe like this. Also know how to go up uh, the quarter pipe. So again, we're gonna just go ahead and take our left foot like you're about to jump into a pool, you know, you're just about to stick a toe in and just drop. All right, so once you've got that, you can begin playing with the idea of airing the transition. Um, If you're very unsure on how to drop in on something, you can also start from a seated position. No shame in it. Something like this. See that drop? No, you don't. You don't even see what you're dropping in on. And so if you're unsure, you can take a hand, pop down. And very cautiously drop in and experience part of it. After that point, even these big guys are the same thing. Just got to keep that confidence, stay solid, get that foot ready. Oh. And drop in. Like I said, I'm no vert skater. That was just me dropping in. Woohoo! All right, guys, so there you have it. How to drop in on a quarter pipe or half pipe. Remember to keep it fun, practice safety. If you're not sure if you're gonna fall, wear a helmet, crash pads, wrist guards, anything that keep you safe and confident. After you've built that confidence, it's up to you what you wanna do. Huge shout out to my patrons. Thank you guys again for your continued support. We got something coming out this week that I'm really excited about. I can't wait to share with my community and my patrons. So thank you guys again. If you guys haven't already, Hit subscribe if you're into these types of videos, want to learn more about rollerblading or aggressive inline skating. Give me a thumbs up if this taught you how to drop in and helped you with that process. Thanks again for all the support. Until next time, keep the blade alive. Aloha.